Hey guys, uh, so we are doing the giveaway a little earlier uh, this week uh, just because I want to give away something else. Um, but yeah, Mild Sauce won uh, this giveaway. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't get a maximum gold box in time, so instead I got another Mega 10 uh, 2020. Uh, see if we can pull uh, something good for you. Uh, hopefully, we can. Uh, again, I will be commenting that you are the winner uh just email me uh at my address and then uh from there i will ship it out to you free of cost of course everything else is everything is included uh even the tin itself of all the cards and uh yeah we'll get this started as you can see brand new uh seal three packs of course and let's get this open now you're wondering why am I doing another recording again? Well, I couldn't uh, really talk that at the time I was doing this opening, so you know I had to mute it, and I, instead I'll just record over it. I actually go by this pretty quick. Uh, we have a Basilisk, a Dino Wrestler, Marshall Ampello. <laughs> trying to get the focusing. A Morch Lag, a Dark Factory of More Production, a Valkyrie Chariot. A her stranger and, and a shinobi ne uh, necro for our super rare and astra goals for our second super nice looking card and then we have neos fusion for our prismatic secret rare and witch's strike for our ultra and dirge of the lost dragon for our ultra so no no dragoon but you know who, who knows someone will pull it eventually uh, Infinite Track, Brutal Dozer, Guard Dragon, Reincarnation, Unchained Twins, Rakia, Evil Eye of Gorgonio. Alright, as you can see, I'm going by this pretty quick just because I was running limited on time. And I go straight to the second pack. As soon as I put this back in there. Alright, so the second pack. see what we have we have a dwimmered glimmer a extra hero cross crusader a gladiator beast sagittari a fury of fire a neo space connector a marintis current a dances with a beast dances with beasts marintis blue slug uh trickstar core bane for our prismatic secret it's a nice looking card and apollosa for our ultra rare uh really good i think it's probably like the fourth or fifth best card in the set really good emperor maju garzette marincis mandarin tyrant dino fusion and salomon great burning shell with dino wrestler esmeranchi dino wrestler terra Picurio, and another evil eye of gorgonio i'm always pulling those uh as you can tell in the title i'm also doing uh the ots pack uh 14 i'm opening uh 15 of those uh it's two separate videos uh, one I showed right now and the other one uh, will be a voiceover the other one will have some audio on it but I don't think I'll be talking in it and we get to the third one but yeah I think I completely forgot who won I think it's mild sauce that one <laughs> so we have infinite track time thief flyback jelly cannon Marincis sea angel uh, infinite track tunneler Gar Dragon and Drake, Witchcrafter, Madame Rare for our Super Rare, Pendulum Halt for our second Super, and a Magicalized Fusion for our Prismatic Secret. I'm not even going to pronounce his name. And then Evil Eye of Selene for our Ultra. And Cap Shell for our Rare. So yeah, no, no Dark Dragoon, no Pot of Extrav, but you did pull a Apollosa, so that's, that's plus. All right, and then on to our uh, OTS packs. Right here, I'm opening up 10 of these. And in another video shortly, it'll be five of them. I'm hoping to get a ultimate rare, hopefully. Again, I don't know, because uh, I bought these from eBay, so I don't know if they're scaled or not. Um, but unfortunately, you know, that's what you do when you buy off eBay, you know, or any seller, in matter of fact. So, I mean, they could have just gave me supers. But uh, yeah, here's the first pack opening. Uh, I did buy 
uh, eight more, but I think I'm just going to hold on to those for a while. Maybe resell them, but I do plan to hold on to those. All right, let's see what we have here. And I do have a, I just started a TCG player uh, selling account. Uh, it's called JT Collecting. I just started it. Um, and I barely sold two cards, one pot of Extrav and one uh, Virtual World Lulu. So that's going good. I just have to ship those out um, tomorrow. This is Friday, so tomorrow, Saturday, I'll have to, have to ship those out. If not, I'm not going to get my money. So we have a dual Avatar Spirit token for our Super Rare for our first pack. I wish I, I wish I went a little faster. I think it's been like what a week since I took this video, or a week and a half. I'm not sure. But I have put them in a binder already and sleeved them up. Uh, so we have uh, Weeping Idol, the Phantom Knights of Shade Brigadine, Unpossessed for our Super Rare, nice card, staple for the uh, Spirit Charmers deck. Yeah, let me know uh, what videos you guys want to see next week. Um, I, I want to get some like new product in here or older product, I guess, and open it on the channel. Um, but definitely, I will do a uh, Void Ogre Dragon, Phantom Knights of Shade Brigadine, and Infernity General for our super third super. And then, um, what was I saying? I totally blanked out. Jesus. I'm not sure what I was saying. Oh, we will be opening up Blazing Vortex. That's one of the things I was going to say uh, once that's released. And then we will be opening up the uh, Rise of the Duelist booster box that I got for my brother on his birthday. So stay tuned for that as well. Weeping Idol, Evil Thorn, uh, a Pointer of the Red Lotus for our fourth super. Uh, decent card. It's about $2, I think, on the TCG Marketplace. We got Raid Raptor Nest, Sheen's Spy, and another Pointer of the Red Lotus, our fifth one. <laughs> I was a, a little bit annoyed <laughs> when I pulled it. I was like, oh, really? But yeah, we got a fifth, a pointer of the red lotus. And but I mean, I'll take it. Yeah, whatever. Uh, I forgot. Oh yeah, I was looking at what you can get. I think it's uh, the entire set. I think it's one, I'm gonna say like twenty six cards or thirty cards, or a little less than that, somewhere around there. Another weeping idol, uh, Sheen's spy, and dual avatar spirit token. That's our second one. I do plan to put some of these up for TCG just because um, when I do my collections, I know some people like to do sets of three. Uh, I just like having at least one of each. Uh, unless it's a card that I really, really like, then I'll do a set of three. But other than that, I just like holding on to one card and then just selling the rest. And this is a Passion Knight, uh, Demise of the Land. And another Pointer of the Red Lotus. So that's three right there. That's an entire playset of the Pointer of the Red Lotus. Can't believe I have three already. Yeah, uh, the next giveaway will be a box of the uh, the new um, the new Duelist series, I guess. One of Kaiba and Mai. I'll be giving away a box of that for our next giveaway. Void Ogre Dragon and another Dual Avatar Spirit Token, so that makes three. <laughs> but yeah, I will be doing giveaway for that. Uh, all you got to do is remember, just like this video, comment, and be subscribed. And then you'll be in the giveaway for that next video. Uh, that giveaway, uh, I think I'll be doing it for uh, the Tuesday. What is it? The Tuesday... Um giveaway when i open up my brother's booster box weeping idol and parallel exceed 
Now, this is actually a pretty good pull because I know right now, at this moment, it's worth about close to $8 on the marketplace. Mm, I'm not really too focused on, like, money aspect, I guess. I mean, I'll sell it, but, I mean, as long as I have one in my collection, I'll be fine. But, I mean, it's always a plus if, you know, you get a really good card and you could make some money out of it. Uh, Weeping Idol. Uh, Phantom Knights of Brigadine. And another parallel exit. So yeah, I will be selling one of these on my TCG Marketplace. And hopefully that sells. Because I don't think it'll plan to go up anytime soon. I feel like it might go down. So I'm going to sell it while it's hot. So yeah, that was the 10 packs in that video. And then, as you can see, I just showcased all the cards that I pulled. Uh, three appointed red lotuses, two exceeds, I think two infinity journals or not? I don't know. Here we have, uh, the five packs that I opened up today. And I did these pretty quick as well. Really hoping I could get an ultra, but I think I'm giving up my hope on that. <laughs> Here we have a weeping idol. Mm, I'm not sure what that was. And then a super that I haven't got, so nice, so I could complete my set. At least partial of my set for that uh, packing. So not bad, not bad. Go on to here. All right, we have a void ogre dragon. Don't know what that is. And then another one that I need uh, for my set: grenade thief, smoke grenade thief. And we're on to our third pack. What is it that we pull? Raid Raptor Nest. And another Infernity General. So that gives me two Infernity Generals. I will be selling one. And on to second to last pack to open. Where was I though? I was somewhere. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing. She and Spy and Weeping Idol and another Dual Avatar Spirit Token. So that gives us four already. So yeah, don't need that many Spirit Tokens. Definitely going to get rid of them. Um, but I hope you guys like this video. Uh, stay tuned for Tuesday's box opening of Rise of the Duelist. Uh, I know right now it's going for like $230 on uh, TCG, which is a lot. So I'm kind of glad I got it for, I think, like 190 or something. Still a lot, but yeah. Stay tuned for that. And another pointer of the Red Lotus. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. And stay tuned for Tuesday, where we'll be doing our next giveaway. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And see you guys next time.